This has gotten tremendous, tremendous uh, reaction on Facebook and social media. Immigrants being dropped off at the Greyhound bus station in downtown Phoenix. Off the bus and they walk away. It's a sight we've been showing you now for days. Bus loads arrive every day. All of them detained in Texas, but because immigration offices can't handle these cases, they're being shipped here to Phoenix. And tonight, we've confirmed that among the hundreds that arrive each day, there are little kids traveling alone with no parent or adult. Fox 10's Jill Monier joins us live with the details. You've been covering this. This is a disturbing sight. These kids, no parents with them? Right, no parents. Immigration and Customs Enforcement admits there are children traveling alone, picked up at the border crossing in Mexico alone flown to Tucson, then bus to Phoenix all by themselves. But they say they are not being released alone. The Greyhound bus station near 24th Street in Buckeye turned into a refuge for busloads of undocumented immigrants being dropped off by the Department of Homeland Security Tuesday, some of them children traveling alone. ICE says Texas is unable to handle the influx of people crossing the border from Mexico and Central America, so they're bringing them to Phoenix, where they will take buses to various destinations as they await their pending immigration cases. Earlier this week, the federal government said they're seeing more girls and more children under 13 crossing the border alone to escape economic conditions, violence, or to reunite with their families in the U.S., calling it an urgent humanitarian situation. We're trying to give them a place to stay, food, everything they need so far, you know, until we could get them on their way home. Erica Fernandez with United Car Club Arizona was among the many volunteers showing up to the bus station with food, water, and clothing. She says she saw kids alone at the bus station. There's a lot of kids left, you know, without parents right now. Um, there's women, you know, with nothing to eat, no food, no clothes, nothing whatsoever. ICE says everyone had to give addresses where they would be staying before being released. This is, I believe, the third bus that just got here, and we're still expecting three more. ICE says the immigrants are on supervised release, some being monitored through GPS. All are supposed to report to ICE in 15 days for their pending immigration cases. Greyhound says they are handing out food and water. They say people can stay at the bus station overnight if needed, but say they have been able to bus out plenty of people. ICE saying they are making accommodations for those who can't afford bus tickets. Reporting live, Jill Monier, Fox 10 News.